Hey there, guys. This is Miss Amy Raven. The other day, uh, a AC water leak popped out, and the house was flooded all over the place. And I put all the towels all over against our room, and Alexa and Dad's room. I shaved all the clothes off. Everything was so wet, but Melania, Joe, and Stephanie, they helped move all the water out of the house. And everything was so wet, wet, wet. All my, I was talking of my homemade doll from Mr. But luckily, a few were safe. But Mom and I were going to dry them out, get them nice and clean, make sure they have no, you know, nothing but free, but it's safe and always, always. Yesterday, I, I couldn't handle the pressure, so I was uh, taking Mrs. house. I was able to take care of her kitten, a little Freya, and also now my sister and her boyfriend had my favorite firehouse sub, my favorite, the uh, club on the side, my favorite, and slept on the road bed, which I haven't done in a long time. Also, um, play with a little kitten, although she was spayed on the 29th because she had to get fixed. Anyway, today I came home and I helped my mom do laundry, and I'm so tired. And everything's all dry up. Other thing at home, clean, nothing went bad. The only thing that was damaged was my two dolls and books, but none of the books survived. But also, here's the biggest scoop. I got a boyfriend. He and I have been um, pen pals for about five years. He's from Australia and he's 26. Same age as my, same age as me. He and I are both just led and he's a very sweet guy. And we've hanged out for like for five years and we've known each other. He has a few siblings. I have one sister. He's 26 and I'm 26. And he's, well, he's a very built guy. He hasn't shown a photo of him yet, but he's a little shy. Plus, his mom and dad won't let me use the computer and take pictures of himself. So, yeah, poor guy. So, I've decided that since he and I have been together so long, I try to make my boyfriend. Well, I asked him first, and he was, trust me. Every time I mentioned about how my boyfriend, or my ex-boyfriend was awful, he would say, I would definitely want to be your girl for your boyfriend. So, Jacob, his real name is, well, it's hard to say his real name. Because, well, his name is hard to say because, well, his name is Joseph. Oh, I'm not, I'm not reading this right. Yeah, his name is hard to say. Okay. Let me see. His name is Joseph Bellamore or Bellamore. It's hard to know. So, yeah, that's his last name. Oh, wait, I hear this. Joseph Bellamore. Yep. That's his last name. He has about at least a few brothers and sisters. He has a mom and dad, although he lost, although he is doing best. But he doesn't want to compete when his family's off. He has to go off. He has to go with them too when he's off the pier. But Jacob is a very sweet guy. I call him Jacob because, well, that's just not, that's just not a nickname here on DA. Yeah, DA, yeah. He and I have been writing stories. We've been writing fan fiction stories for my Mute 6 page. And for my other page, a DA. He's been helping me write my novels, my fantasy novels. Right now, we're working on a Christmas spy story. It's going to be wonderful. Anyway, I'm actually happy because, well, I've been lonely and really sad. But Jacob, he has he has given me advice how to handle, how to, how to have a strong relationship with my mother. He's been very, very, very supportive about me. Want to learn how to drive. He's been supportive about my dolls. He's been supportive about everything I do. Heck, he's been supportive of my, of my music when I'm singing. So this guy has it all. He is supportive and he does drive, but he lives in Australia. I don't really know if he drives or not, but at least he has a job. Yeah, he works. So yeah, Jacob is my guy. Besides, Every single picture I fa every single picture I paint, he likes it very much. And even though I know that I'm very good at drawing. But he tries too. He and I are both the same. I know, I know, but he's wonderful. That's all I have to say. So, Jacob, see the video. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Adios, amigos, everyone. Bye bye.